this pot won't talk. <coughs> I was really hoping that would break. <laughs> Welcome back to Let's Play No One Lives Forever. I'm Burning Dog Face. And uh, Agent Archer is in a whole heap of trouble. Seems like the whole world's gunning for me. And now my shoes are wet. Man. What sort of getaway did you have in mind? Something quiet and romantic. It's for our anniversary. Well, in that case, perhaps Azru might just be the ticket. It's quiet and less touristy than Fez. That sounds marvelous. Do you have any brochures? Sure. Here you are. Thank you. Who's there? Get back here! Man, all I wanted was to sneak up and punch him in the head, but I wanted to listen to his stupid conversation, too. Alright, tell me everything you know about Fez. Really, I didn't know that was a place. Ah, oh, fuck. <laughs> that really sounds like it should hurt, doesn't it? Even that doesn't sound like it should hurt as much. Nope, he's a civilian. Oh. This vacation is exactly what I needed. I wanted to go to France, but Clark insisted on coming to Morocco. Oh. Sorry, Martha. 1954, Lord Archer committed suicide. Kate, then 12 years old, entered the Brighton Home for Little Wanderers, where she remained for six months before disappearing. Observation, it seems Miss Archer's history is not unlike that of you-know-who. Coincidence, or perhaps a fateful portent? Consult Madame Sasha for insight. I want to get out and see the Medina, but it's so hot outside. You sound exactly like a guy I know. Sudden craving for croissant. For <clears throat> I have a sudden craving for croissant. Any sign of her yet? Nope. Damn, I gotta pee. Well, go then. What if she shows up while I'm in the restroom? Good point. Can you hold it? I guess so. <laughs> that man has just pissed his pants. Dang it. I suppose they would have noticed that. I wonder. Man. Get down, everybody! Oh. Those were dumb dumb rounds. Yeah, I thought the enemies only used standard ammo. Ah, oh, God, no. I don't actually believe you're dead, so there's that.
boo. I see you. Dig the music. Right. They probably have a conversation. But fuck it. Are you okay? Oh, it's reloaded. That's weird. What the fuck am I trying to do? We're in the main lobby. I've thought I came to the main lobby like four times now. <coughs> My knowledge of French is too rudimentary to remember what that sign means. Christ in a boat, I have no idea where I am. I took a chance and I was right. That man was sinister. God! Oh, 38 dumb dumb rounds. I know I shouldn't do that, it's just... very annoying. I wonder if there's a mod to fix that. You don't knock on the elevator, Kate! Let me hop our way back out there, because I do want to check out that pool. Oh! Oh wait, is that just the exit to this room, or is it like saying this is where the exit is? So I'm calling it, I think Bruno's gonna die. Arm alert. All agents that be on lookout for Unity Agent Kate Archer, a 5'7 brunette of Scottish slash English descent. Report sightings to Executive Director Volkov. Warning, do not attempt to apprehend her without written consent from your supervisor. If your supervisor is not available, it is permissible to obtain authorization by telephone, providing that a Class A dispatcher is available. <laughs> that is very silly. Evil spies have to deal with shitty paperwork. Late, as usual. I was beginning to worry. Well... You always worry. Can you blame me? You're like an errant child. And you're like a fussy aunt. You could at least leave my gender intact. A fussy uncle, then. Thank you. I'm having fun. I can see that. But don't get reckless. We're not out of danger yet. I know. This place is crawling with thugs. Damn! How did they find us? We've been betrayed. It's the only explanation. Are you sure you weren't followed? Yes, positive. If they know about the hotel, they'll probably be waiting for us at the coast. We'll have to risk it. If we aren't aboard the Abigail when she sails, we'll have to get out of Morocco on our own. Or you could stay here. Permanently. Volkov! 
Get down! Let's go! I have dreamed about this day for six years. No. no, no. I only regret I do not have time to make your demise more eventful. After him. This is all my fault. If you hadn't been worrying about me, he never would have got the drop on you. <sighs> Silly girl. Worrying about you is all I have left. Don't say that. I've always had plenty to die for. You've given me something to live for. Then live. In your memory, perhaps. Bruno! The girl's in the lobby. Kill her! But why didn't you kill her, Mr. Volkov? I meant to, but my hunger for revenge distracted me. Let that be a lesson not to be ruled by your emotions. Excellent advice, sir. Well, I'll go shoot her now. <laughs> Make sure there are no witnesses. You mean we should kill everybody? First, kill everybody. Then, destroy the hotel. Let our enemies search the rubble for answers. They shall find none. Who oh, no. Your death will be avenged. Hell, I can't interact with that. That's better. Kate, you may sometimes come across intelligence items that you cannot recover because you lack a necessary gadget. If you want to come collect these items, you need to come back later with different equipment. Bruno. Okay. Thank you. One last bit of wisdom. Okay, uh, disarm explosives and rescue hostages, prevent civilian casualties. I guess the, uh, revolver being her signature weapon is shorthand for that's what she uses in cutscenes. Last words, dude. I'm not doing well. Fine, let's use it's easy, stupid, dumb, dumb rounds. But first, let's do something even stupider. Hmm. Eh, fine. Go ahead, you have and see what you want to move. Thank you. You're welcome. Craving that only armor can suffice. Or can satiate. You guys have awful aim! Holy shit! Contains piece 89G7 of the CT 180 and a tattered sheet of paper upon which is written Leon, your wife called. Your mother will in law will arrive for supper promptly at 7 p.m. Don't forget to pick up a bottle of wine. If you'll tolerate a recommendation, I'd suggest Maison de Runel's Zinfandel. Any vintage before 60 should, suffi should suffice. 57 is especially superb, as more recent years betray a distinctly undesirable fruitiness. My own chemical analysis suggests the use of lower-quality pesticides as the chief culprit, Santa. <laughs> what the fuck?
organs. Are you all right? No, you've just shot me to death. All right, there is no aiming down the sights. Fine, let's do it the old-fashioned way and fucking. Ah, god damn it! Got five, not this time, without getting caught in the damn furniture! No! Oh, they still got the fat man! Eh. Straight you are. Did you see a fucking spider or something? I don't mock. They can get really big in this part of the world. I have no idea if that's true or not. <laughs> oh! I missed this. Harm file 2289, Catherine Archer. No records exist between 55 and 63. However, activities of the Fox, a notorious female thief, coincide with Archer's known location during the period. Could it be that Kate Archer was once an infamous cat burglar? If so, what went wrong? He's just passing out, fine. Hello, bad guys. I'm very clearly announcing my position. Help me! He's a... He's a oh. you saved my life. One more for old time's sake. Oh, it opens in! Is someone there? Help me! Oh, thanks. Oh, I'm almost dead. I need to keep rushing in in order to save the civilians. Help me! Oh. Is that you? You know what? Fuck it. Worth a test. You cannot get away. Ooh. Nice. Roll down the fucking stairs and everything. Ah, oh, I'm way back here. Fine. At least I have a smidge more health. You aren't real to real tapes. You're just a stack of plates. I knew that. I've been here before. I swear that's exactly the same sound effect when you zoomed in in uh, Shogo. Though it made more sense there because a lot of the time you. Well, a lot of the time you were controlling a giant robot, and when you weren't, you were still using crazy futuristic weapons. Help me! Who's the ah! you saved my life! Hmm. 
Who is here? Help me! Help me! Man, stop doing that! You're really freaking me out. Oh no, do I need to check all the rooms again to see if any intel has appeared? Is this one of those games? Oh, that wasn't smart. <clears throat> Fuck with the stairs! Ah, oh, I'm lost already. That's not the map. The only map is in my head, which means I'm doomed, basically. I found the stairs. That's a victory for me. Thank you. Scene three. Need to reload my armor. Oh. You can't hide from me, Volkov. I'll find you wherever you go. Kill her, you incompetent fools. There goes the timer, so uh I'm Burning Dog Face, and I'll see you in the next episode of Let's Play. No one lives forever. When we blow all those guys away, and then get back on the trail of Volkov. Was it Dmitry Volkov? I want to say it's Dmitry Volkov. It was DV, anyway. Later.